Um, let's just check out the money one, right? So the money one in the training, there is a new money trove here. Um, it gives about what 20k, right, for the clear rewards. Um, if you kill the monster, you get 24k for 24 mana. Um, it's not that great, but it's there if you need it. But they do actually give you a uh, mission though. That one time clear missions that if you clear all three of them, right, it's total 100k. So you can collect that extra 100k right there. And then we also got a new dungeon, which is the equipment dungeon. Uh, usually you want to do these in co op, right? For co op, there's training. This is for the wind set and the earth set on the left side. So this is the armor set, not the accessory set. Um, it gives you 21% flat damage. So this is technically better than your strength set. So if you're using an earth unit or a wind unit, you should farm for these because these are better. And there is actually a level 5 on this one. Um, it doesn't guarantee a 5 star though, but I believe it does give increased chance compared to the four, level 4 one. Unfortunately, there's no level 5. They didn't drop a level 5 for these other ones, but that they have that. And then we have the mana trader, the mana coin trader here in the shop. Um, unfortunately, you can only trade down, right? <laughs> you can't trade up. So if you have uh, a lot of copper, you're stuck with more copper. <laughs> and apparently chat yeah, it says it's a scam, so um, it is pretty much uh, kind of useless because a lot of us need more of the gold ones at the moment, right? So you pretty much can only trade your gold to silver, which is like a three times, and then you can trade your silver into copper, which is double. So you can pretty much trade your gold to copper six times. So be careful if you actually want to get gold stuff. It's not you're gonna make yourself get less. So just be just be wary of that. I haven't used this because I I don't need any of this. Um, I rather just farm it myself. Um, I don't. I necessarily need more of the gold one, not the copper ones. And we also got better AI. So I did was I did try running floor seventy with the new AI. I tried to three star. I did get two star, but. They still get hit by like the the red targeting stuff. They they still still kind of get hit from that. Uh, they do at least get out of the red zones, so that's good. And they do, um, or maybe I'm just, or maybe I'm just thinking it does, but maybe it doesn't. They still get hit a lot. Um, but sumo do heal quite a bit more, more often, and everything like that. So that's at least better. Am I missing anything else? I don't know. Let's check the news real quick. So these are the new updates that they they, they said that we're going to get. Oh, we also did get dailies. I forgot to go over that. So we did get dailies, AI behaviors, uh, decreased required. So there is a campaign happening right now, if you guys didn't know. It's only temporary, but hopefully they make it permanent that, that everything costs like one third of the actual cost. Angela is still stuck on auto. Yeah, they they mostly work on the the characters that do healing. And let's see what else am I missing? I I haven't got this issue yet where it freezes for me because I'm used to Pixel Six, but apparently that's supposed to be fixed and stuff. But yeah, let's go over to the dailies. The dailies are nice. I have to say the dailies are nice. So if we go to missions. Right, we do get extra pots. Right here, if you clear a quest five times, you get five stamina pots. If you clear five training dungeons, you get five of the SP pots or the EP pots, the blue stamina. So they added those, that's great. So you can start hoarding up if you want to, because they're, now they're, you can use as many pots as you want. So if you don't want to run it all the day during everything right now, right, you can save it up and run it another day. But that's my update. The only thing that's nice, I was hoping they would actually drop a level 5 gear dungeon for the other ones, but they didn't. But still, new dungeon, and it's very good. Uh, Mana Trainer, 
Kind of sucks. Kind of useless right now. Um, this new daily change is good. Um, the money one, eh, it's okay. <laughs> it's okay, but I'd rather just do that one time just to get to the one time quest thing. Get that out of the way. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So if you guys want to run some co-op and stuff, do check out my streams. I do stream, uh, my social should be down below. Uh, Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, and Sunday. Most likely gonna be Echoes. Uh, but sometimes there's some other games, but yeah, feel free to check that out. And yeah, that, that's pretty much it. That's for the review live on Twitch and YouTube right now. Yeah.